Hey everybody, welcome back to the... Hey guys, what is up? Today we are going to be trying to do the... Shit. I'm very sorry. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be doing the reverse space bar. So, let's get right into it. For the inconvenience of me not giving up. What you think? So the first thing you guys want to do is uh, get the side uh, alts or uh, all the keys that are close to it. I'm only going to take out the alt and the other alt, just these both. You guys can take out these sides as well if you like, but I'm going to be doing these ones. So yeah. So with the uh, alt keys all gone, now we are going to be doing right over here. We have to remove both, like from the both sides. The stabilizers are right over there. If you have an old keyboard, you guys could go watch the video from Switch and Click. It will show you uh, like how the stabilizers are all over there. You can take out and everything. But because of this uh, keyboard being new, so that is why the stabilizers are down there in the case over here. So you can't see the stabilizer, so it's pretty easy to take it out. And th this is all, everything like the new keyboard, so I'm going to remove it. One second. So as you guys can see, I just removed it. So now that this is out, you guys can see that there are no stabilizers. They're right inside, right over here. Uh, focus, for God's sake. Yes. So you guys can see right over there, the stabilizers are right over there, so that's a good thing. But in the old keyboards, the stabilizers are stick up with it, so it's a big problem. You guys can go watch Switch and Click if you guys want to know how to do it, if you guys have an old keyboard. Well, it's pretty simple now. All you guys got to do is rotate and just keep it back in. Just take care that you don't put it in the wrong way. Or else it could damage the space bar or the stabilizers. And that is a really bad thing to do. And there you go. As you guys can see, there we have it. It's a reverse space bar now. I'll just press it a little hard for now so that everything's in. Perfect. So there we have it. Now I can just add back the keycaps. So there you guys have it. The reverse space bar is done. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like the video, please, guys. You guys, I'm on. I'm really low on subscribers, so please. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.